Looks like a positive trend in doctor's offices and ERs may actually not be as good as it looks. Local News 8's Emma Ionacone tells us how our usual health concerns are taking a back seat to the coronavirus. It's a catch-22. Health officials say some people are avoiding the doctor's office to avoid contracting the coronavirus. Everyone is reporting a just a huge decrease in the amount of people coming to their offices. And that's while that's good from a social distancing standpoint, it's it's obvious that people are not getting the health care that they need. Doctors at the Portneuf Medical Center say that's just as dangerous. Uh, we know, though, that heart attacks and strokes and um, other medical issues uh, aren't going to stop. Doctors are worried people who need medical attention are too afraid to get it. It's causing a nationwide spike in people dying in their homes. So doctors say we need to find a balance between battling the virus and maintaining our health. First of all, if it is an emergency, absolutely come in. We have, we have great processes to keep everyone safe. We wear masks 100% of the time. All patients are masked. Their rooms are disinfected thoroughly uh, between patient visits. Telehealth conferences can even replace some doctor's visits. Patients need to be contacting their doctor. Doctors say people are more likely to have permanent problems if they avoid emergency or necessary medical care. Just because we have this pandemic doesn't mean that diabetes, heart disease, high blood pressure, psychiatric illness have gone away. Those things are still there. In Pocatello, I'm Emma Iannacone. You can read more about this trend on our website at localnews8.com.